Hello everyone and welcome to the Nightfall. I'm playing this game a while. <coughs> oh god, sick as fuck. And no, it's not for me acting sick. It's 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 pretty bad. I'm not sure if it's a sick fucking sick sick cold or flu. Then I should be in bed. But I can stay up a little bit longer, because I know if I go to bed, it won't be for like eight hours, probably. So let's get back into this game. It's like 10.30 now, and I have to figure out what I'm doing in this game. While exploring. Um, seeing what other shit's fucking wrong with this fucking house. Oh, the shadows are just that bad now, are they? I, I, I don't want the game to lag, you know? But yeah, okay, so I'm trying to figure out what went wrong. The last... Oh, okay, well, you got a key. <laughs> and the last episode, for those unaware... Also, do we have more shit in the, in the fridge? Weird, okay. Never mind, I thought I saw something. We got some lemons. We're not going to eat the lemons. We're going to drink some beer, though. Um, I don't like beer. Bitch, you like it. Drink. I don't like beer. No, drink it. Yeah, that's right. I'm not thirsty now. The, just the later. tall ones on the bottom. The ones at the top she, she didn't want. I don't know, maybe it was fucking iced tea. God, I sound like shit. But, getting some videos out would be for the best, even if I'm fucking sick. Like, I've seen PewDiePie do it when he's sick. I've seen Mark Blair do it when he's sick. I, I don't have an excuse. I want this to become a job. And being sick is, is not too much, you know, of an excuse. Um, I mean, I feel like shit. I've had... Lots of soup. Lots of fucking soup. And maybe I'll get one more coffee before I go to bed. Um, questionable. Um, candles, matches. The right mouse pot to open inventory. So we got, okay. Uh, what? Well, what would open it? You need no, no sledgehammer. Um, sir, let's just keep looking around this room. I'm. More I already have five spare batteries. No, you don't, bitch. Um, I, I, I don't know. It's just uh, I don't know. I, I'm feeling like shit. I'm not sure if it's cold or flu, because I know in America there's a super flu going on. I don't know if that's what I have. If someone just you know has it and it's coming into Canada. I already have ten matches. I, I have no idea. Um. I just know I feel like shit, and typically I have a high, high immune system, so typically when I do get sick, it's literally just sniffles and a runny nose, and I, my body destroys it in the day. I, I have a really good fucking immune system, but right now, whatever I have, it, I got it when I was grocery shopping for new fucking recycling bins uh, to spruce up my apartment, since my roommate still has to get his last remaining things out of his room. And then I want to try to order a big, fat fucking rug. So my, my new room, the big room, will have a sexy rug in it. Um, so anyone that's interested in hearing at least commentary, non-game related, while I roam in this house looking to see what's different, because it is a walking simulator. Oh, here we go. Book stack. Push it. No. This isn't spooky, but maybe the page we need to read is in here. We already read that one. No idea. Well, uh, yeah. I want to order a big, fat fucking rug for the room. The only issue I know is I will more than likely, like, I, I want to try to find a roommate before, you know, I have to pay too many full months rent. Because typically, when in my room here, when my roommate was here, I only had to pay, like, four fifteen, and split the energy and split the internet price. It wasn't too bad. But now, with me being myself, I'm paying for the electricity, which is, like, 50 bucks a month. Internet, which is like 45, 40 or forty-five dollars a month, and eight hundred ninety-one on my own. Uh, YouTube, I don't get enough YouTube money to really, you know, pay for that. That's why I'm like getting more and more nervous to think I might have to really rush and actually create a Patreon. As much as usually in the past, I was like, I was really, I'm, I still am reluctant in doing Patreon or GoFundMe because I, I see this as a hobby that would hopefully become a job rather than viewing it as a source of money or doing it out of any means of like either greed or anything like that because it's just 
I don't know, I feel like I'm gonna need support. Um, and I know a lot of people in my past, in, during streams, and a lot of videos, a lot of comments, and discussions, and PMs of people saying, Hey Nico, why don't you set one up? I'll give you, uh, like, I'll pay. And I know there's actually people that are willing to support me, and my content, and my channel. So, I mean, I, I just have to think of what things would be good to set up, like, uh, the only thing I'm thinking so far is, and I'm sure this would be better off in a fucking vlog, also I guess I know I was just in this room, shh, is uh, something about super chat. I'm so not used to YouTube's stream algorithm, but I hear there's custom images, like custom icons, like in Twitch, uh, for super chat. I remember this being here. And, um, so what I'd probably do is, like, Patreon supporters, I'd have to think what kind of rewards I can give. I think one of them... I seriously don't remember this closet. I already have five spare batteries. Fuck off. Now you have more. Is, uh... Patreon awards. But it'd probably be just like, like you know, petty cash. Nothing huge. It'd just be like maybe five bucks and that's it. And the reward would be like, your name in the credits with my new outro I'm gonna have to try to make. Um try to get it so I can get an artist to commission to make super chat unique exclusive icons for people that pay a bit more um, let's touch this not again yet, why not little friend why, why not so I, I have all that in my mind I got probably gonna have to do um, oh I didn't notice you're the you're the a witch sure I'm gonna assume the the note will be here but yeah, outside of Patreon, it's just, I'm, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna think I'm gonna have to do that really soon. Cause rent's gonna be a bitch real fast, like real fast. I don't, I'm not gonna, lo I'm not looking forward to it. Ugh, especially with the whole thing, like... Well, I didn't see anything. Or am I just blind? I, I seriously didn't see anything. Okay. Yeah. So Patreon rewards, new outro with names on the out on the credits is all I have planned so far. I, I I'll take suggestions, of course. I'm not really familiar with the norms, the usual, but it would be better off for the channel. So then I know I can have a flow of petty cash, anything, pennies, anything really. I mean, so I can use that money. What? So I can just use that money to concentrate, like, this money will be for YouTube, will be for computer, will be for... And yes, I said computer, I know. Um, YouTube stuff, computer stuff, video games that I buy out of my own personal money. Um, if I could make it so my personal money is left only for rent and survival money, basically, while Patreon money is all exclusively YouTube, so I don't have to keep doshing out money for ch like YouTube when the money should go towards food and you food and rent stop with the music but that's basically my plans so I gotta have it so I get the patreon or GoFundMe set up I, I just don't know when I because I'm trying to think of how I would set up the outro I'm looking at like a new song I really like that's royalty free uh, all I'm looking for is like a, a sort of Sort of a, a tribute to old films in like a sort of a presentation, like sort of a projector projecting a montage of scenes that happened in the current episode. There'd be no more showing previous episodes unrelated to the one. Like usually it's just, you know, it's a it's a TV screen of a previous video of a different game I'd randomly put in there. I think I'm going to just put like a montage of my face, silly moments or funny moments in game sort of shit and have a montage while Angry Loaf watches angrily. Where the fuck am I going? Metal noise? Trash can? What's with the noise? I seriously don't know where I'm going. I don't want to rant anymore until I have some progression at the very least. No. What? You, bitch. Anything else in here? No, but seriously, what? The doors keep opening and closing in random rooms. I'm not sure if that actually starts 
a scripted event or not. Is that a Toy Story 3 bear or something? Nah, I don't know. Well, I never remembered this chandelier being in this bathroom. To be honest, it, it's kind of weird. I don't remember ever seeing it. I'm just going to leave all the faucets on. I don't know why. I, I got it like this wrench, monkey wrench. And usually I would signal it has to do with sinks and water. So I'm just going to... Like, you know, they tear, like turning something. Like something's loose or something's tight. I need to adjust something. But it's like... The fuck in the house would be that, except for gas related or water related? I don't fucking know. No, I didn't notice this fucking creepy ass monkey was uh, within these with these fucking toys. Look at this fucking thing. No, seriously, it's like got fuck. It's got fucking blood on its teeth. It's that monkey I fucking hate. It has to be the creepiest fucking thing ever, of course. It with its uh, with its mouth like that. That's. I don't like that fucking monkey. I seriously have no idea where I'm going, and I'm getting... Ugh, my head is killing me. Maybe actually I can use it to... Jesus Christ. Okay, now the kitchen. Why? Just to... For suspense? Maybe I can use this to fix the phone. Maybe that's what I needed to do the whole time. I fixed the wire. Oh, I hope it works. oh God! Really? All that time, and it was for the fucking phone. God damn it, man! This is the police emergency number. How can I help you? Hello. Hi, my name is Victoria Miller. I'm locked in my own house, and strange things are happening. Hello? Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you, and I need help. Hello? Hello? Listen, this line is for emergencies only. This is an emergency. I need help. Please, do not call again with that reason. I, I love how it's like... <laughs> Shit! You in my kitchen, bitch? You in my kitchen? Get the fuck out of my fucking kitchen! Oh, I think that's left by the, the clown. Um, oh, what was I going to say? I like how uh, the 911 police can't hear you. That's the whole point of the story. Like, the the the, the output, say the receiver, you can't, they can't hear you. But they have the common courtesy and coincidental timing of only responding after you're done talking. It's kind of funny. The whole damn evening, I drove around the district of Union Hills only to find that the problem comes from the overhead wire. Some prankster actually shattered the distribution box for the phones. Who climbs up the mast and does something like that? A brat. Nobody could make calls the whole evening. Oh. I could only fix the box next morning by daylight. Oh. Either it was just a case of vandalism, or someone wanted to stop phone calls from being made in Union Hills. Ooh. Spooky. All that time <laughs> that I was looking around for where the fuck the note is, it's just the wrench for the phone. I hadn't put the two together except until after I was like, if it's not... Like, I said well, what it was gas or water at first. It's 11 p.m., 7 hours until sunrise. That's not a long fucking time. Um, I said, when looking at the fireplace, I was like, well, maybe it's a gas fireplace. Maybe I have to tighten it to turn it on. Squeak. Anyways, I probably ranted enough about vlog-like stuff. My head's killing me. I think I'm just gonna do this and the other previous video. I'm gonna leave it here and hope you enjoy this episode, even if I sound like complete ass. If you did enjoy, please leave a like, comment, hit that subscribe button, become my full subscriber. Hit that bell notification down below for updates on my videos. Thank you for watching, and until the next time. Arrgh.